everyone, it is I, Multi12689, and welcome back to Let's Tap. Uh, with an awkward fade in because, you know, I'm bad. But, anyways, welcome back. We're, today we're gonna be playing again some more uh, Tap Runner, I think that's what it's called. Whatever, Top Let's Runner. Tap. Also, I didn't edit this intro as well as I thought I was going to. But we're gonna play some more Tap Runner and finish the row of that, and then we're gonna play again a few of the rhythm taps to unlock more stuff, and then that's gonna be it. So, yeah. So, interestingly enough, I did say in the last part, when we finished doing the worst game mode in the game, Visualizer, that I had something interesting to talk about regarding this game. Uh... Oh gosh. Okay, so, there is stuff that you can unlock, and it does say here, uh, fulfill the following conditions to unlock extra game modes. So... To clear, if you clear silent blocks, mode, alchemist, or slash alchemist, uh, unlocking, I don't know how you clear the game, I mean, you get one of everything, so you get pretty much up to diamond, and then you got this, I'm pretty sure that's what that is. Uh, After you, after you get up, after you get up to diamond to beat the mode, even though you don't really need it, you just kind of get there. Uh, unlock additional binary mode. Yeah, using only red and blue blocks, and try to get the highest score you can in a hundred turns. Interesting, right? Because you know, playing for like fifty turns wasn't interesting enough. You play for a hundred. Uh, anyways, that's what you get if you beat silent blocks. Which is not a very good bonus mode if you ask me about it. Whatever. Um, for Rhythm Tap, if you get tracks with S, plus, S or higher, which if they're higher than S, then what is wrong with this game? Uh, you can unlock in one additional song, which you can unlock an additional four songs. We'll see when that road comes, if I'm gonna do it, because by, by this, this video that we're on right now, the one that I'm recording on the 8th of... October at 9.47 at night, doing post-commentary for this, and, uh, yeah, uh, let's just say, uh, I, I don't know if I'm gonna do that, but we're gonna see. And if you clear Visualizer, or the gem game, you want to lock Ocean Mode. Send bubbles from the bottom of the ocean and see what lurks. Also, in the bottom here, which also I found on the back of the game, is something that we really need to talk about. Alright, so, also I don't remember, I got first, okay. Um, here's, also Sega made another game called Let's Catch. Now I know what you guys are wondering, Multi, please don't play another Let's game. And don't worry, I'm not going to, but, uh, let me read the back of, uh, the, what, literally the back of the instruction manual for Let's Tap has an advertisement for the predecessor game with, with Let's Catch. Are you ready? Here we go. Let's Catch. Play Catch with your friends in a multiplayer party game. Can you already tell how unimpressed I am? Let's play catch with your friends in multiplayer party games. You know, like hot potato. Or catch. The actual outside sport that you can do with the actual people. Without a wheel mode. Okay. Uh, compete in high scores using your knees and other characters. Because we can't really give you Sonic the Hedgehog, because that's not what you want. You want Let's Catch. Okay, so here we go. This is the catch. This is the selling point, apparently. Catch. Catch. Choose. Okay, let me read this in my notes here. Choose from six different single and multiplayer modes, such as Speed Catch, which tests your ability to catch a fast ball. 
because you know this is gonna really help you for real life. <laughs> uh, bomb catch for you know terrorists. The black arms will rise again. Okay, so, sorry. Uh, <laughs> God, that can't even. An elimination party game for up to four players to select a very up to four players. So pretty much, anyways, what I was trying to say before I made that horrible, horrible joke that actually isn't pretty funny at all. Uh, pretty much they have a bomb game where, you, hey, if you don't catch it at the right time, you get eliminated. Go, 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 go. You know, hot potato? Anyway. I'm sorry, yeah, that's what it makes me mad. Uh, select from a variety of characters. Use your knees to play your favorite game. Buy now and unlock features for Let's Catch and Let's Pass when you own both titles. Wonderful. Isn't this wonderful? This is what Sega has be had become in 2007 through 8. This is why we wash our hands. So we don't get germs like those. Anyway, <laughs> I'm pretty brutal. I'm pretty brutal this evening. Because, man, I'm actually at the point right now where I'm just like, oh, no. <laughs> Alright, time to go see the other game. Let's see if it has the actual link in the Wikipedia. Ah, uh, here we go. It's actually, I can link, I can... Because I actually have the Wikipedia pulled up from, like, what, two or three parts ago? So, uh, I, I'm just taking advantage of this now. Alright. So, for the WiiWare, we got Let's Catch. This... Excuse me? Ho 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 hold on the hold, 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 hold the phone. Hold the phone, alright. So here I'm gonna probably put up some images and stuff for this, but um Yeah. So Let's Catch didn't come out until June 19th, 2009. Alright? And as as we recalled Let's Tap, on the other hand, came out, like, what? It was... It doesn't show the data immediately, so that's really good. It didn't come out... But let's... Oh, never mind. I am incorrect. For... For America, or European, I guess, it came out in 2000... June 2000... June, the game actually came out in 2009 for us, and... Uh, June 16th or 19th, it doesn't really say specific for you at this point. But, uh... Okay. I was gonna say, that was about to raise my concern levels. Okay, so never mind. So, actually, Let's Catch and Let's Tap came out around, actually, on, like, the same days. Which I'm like, okay. Because I was about to get really mad and say, like, why would they be... Why would the Let's Tap game that has unlockable features that you can unlock immediately if you got Let's Catch? If it's gonna be a year away from the other game. Like, what? What? I would've been really mad. Alright, so... Story mode, story mode. Apparently this game, Let's Catch, has a story mode. Oh my gosh, does not sound riveting. Also this game I don't think ever got rated. Nope. There is not a single review on this game. I do not blame reviewers. Um, nine Trials. Okay, so the other two, two modes... Are you kidding me? So the other mode other than story mode is the Nine Trials. Uh, up to four players, each player given a board with nine panels. Uh, race to see who can throw their ball through all the panels for the fastest. You know, there's a very thin line to a video game in a, in a iOS, you know, an iOS, uh, title. This is, this is crossing that line. And I don't want to even look at the title. I don't want to even look at how much this game costs. Probably costs the same amount, which was $25. Unless... High score. Two people continuously throwing the balls in order to catch them and get the high score. Dropping. 
Well, Sega, I'm sorry, but uh, I'm pretty sure you dropped the ball in this game. Like, look, I know that joke is, that joke is just horrible and it was predictable as, you know, you know, the world dying because of natural causes, but uh, let's be honest here. High score mode, a game where you can throw a ball, continuously throwing balls, in order to get the highest score without dropping the ball. That's the premise. It's actually horrible. And free play. Two players can practice mode and simply just throw balls at each other. As you can tell, multi gets really impressed. Alright, so we're gonna see if we can find a price for let's catch. This actually needs to be, I actually need to see, so I can be very disappointed. Actually, I kind of want to see if I can find the trailer, but uh, I'm not going to, because I already did a full one stop, and I'll probably get flagged by Nintendo, because, you know, I should stuff. Let's see. Did it ever get? No, it never got. It never got reviewed. Let's stop. It never got. Alright, time to see if I can find a price for this game. Sega was not stupid about Let's Catch Up. They actually... The price for... Well, actually, this might not even be the original price. Because again, I'm going to an external website to try to see if I can find the price in there. I can't seem to find a price. I actually can't seem to find a price. But the only price I was able to find without going into a website, uh, $14. Which is reasonable, but when you think about it, if somebody was to buy Let's Catch and Let's Tap, you're buying two games for almost $50. Which have, like, lack only like out of both the games. I can't speak for Let's Cat. The Let's Tap only has like two or three playable games that actually are fun. And then you got probably Let's Cat, which all of those games are relatively stupid. Why? Why? Why even have a thing? Also, I thought I was ending off the video because I wasn't watching it because I was researching. Researching quote unquote these things. I wasn't. So that's just proves how silly I am. But yeah, if you were wondering what I'm doing, I'm trying to get B and above so I can unlock the next row song. So that's pretty much what I end up doing. But yeah, pretty much at, at the end of the day, Sega made this. You know, I don't expect a lot from Sega. Because, you know, I'm not saying Sega's a horrible company. I'm not saying that. They fall a long, they have fallen a long way from where they began, you know? And they gotta do whatever they gotta do, but... This? I mean, it makes good work, but I don't know. I honestly kind of am curious on how much they even made from this game. I'll probably check on my own time or the next time we report stuff or that stuff, but... Oh my gosh, I have never been more depressed as a human being, other than this. And yeah, so in any case guys, actually I think that we're gonna get the ending sooner here, because uh, I don't go back to the main screen for this one. 
as I show off all the thongs that I unlocked now that I got beyond every thong. So, any, in any case, guys, I have been multi one two six nine nine. and the next time, we'll be heading through song 5 to 8. So, until then, I have been multi one two six nine nine, and I will catch you chows next time. So, ciao ciao until then.